I will take question number four. Choose the correct option. Justify your choice. Justify your choice. Here only we will write the answers and how to write the answers that I will tell you. No justification. First one. 9 into sec square a minus 9 into tan square a equal to a 1 b 9 c 8 d 0 So how do you get the answer for it? Please see here, choose the correct option is there. They have not asked you to guess the correct option. You should not guess here. You have to calculate quickly and right. Here 9 is common, you take outside. And what is sex square A? Sex square A is 1 plus tan square A. Minus tan square A as it is. This is sex square A. This is given tan square A. 9 is outside. So you get 9 into the bracket. If you open the bracket tan square A, tan square A will cancel. Into 1 answer becomes 9. So what is option? Option is B. You can write if you want using 1 plus tan square A equal to sex square A. All identities should be there in your brain and you should be able to recall them. Very quickly. And such problems you can also solve in other way. I will tell you. How is that? A and A are there. You put some angle value. You put here some angle value. And simplify. You take A equal to 45 degree. You take A equal to 45 degree. And see what happens. Sec 45 is root 2. Sec square 45 is 2. Root 2 square is what? 2. Minus. Tan 45 is 1. Tan square 45 is also 1. So 9 into 2 minus 9 into 1. 18 minus 9 is 9. Answer is 9 only. I will tell you that also. Or, or, what you can do? Take A equal to 45 degree.
then 9 into sec square 45 minus 10 square 45 will get 9 into root 2 square minus 1 square Nine into two minus one. Two minus one is one. Nine into one is nine. Again, you get the same answer. So this way also you can calculate. Sometimes this works out to be very good option that you will see in next question. The second way of solving the problems becomes very good option or very good tool that you will see in next problem. Second one. One plus tan theta plus sec theta into 1 plus cot theta minus cosec theta equal to A option 0, B option 1, C option 2, and D is minus 1, and D is minus 1. Then also remember one more thing, when your options are, listen to me very carefully, when your options are numerical values, here 0, 1, 2, minus 1, 1, 9, 8, 0, like this, better you take some specific angle in place of theta and calculate. That will save your time. If numerical values are not there, if any trigonometric ratio is there, then you have to make use of identities. Okay? So now, let theta equal to 45 degree. Why I select theta equal to 45 degree? That is also very important. If I take theta equal to 0, cot theta becomes infinity. If I take theta equal to 90 degree, tan theta will become infinity. Is it right? So avoid such angles which can give you infinite values. You take 45 degree as standard. Then in first bracket, 1 plus 10 45 plus sec 45. Another bracket, 1 plus cot 45 minus cosec 45 minus cosec 45. Substitute the values. 1 plus 1 plus root 2. 1 plus 1 minus root 2. What it will become? 2 
2 plus root 2 into 2 minus root 2. It is of the form. Now the result here is of the form a plus b a minus b. A plus b into a minus b. Use a square minus b square. See every identity that you have learnt is important now. Using a plus b into a minus b equal to a square minus b square. What you get 2 plus root 2 into 2 minus root 2 is equal to 2 square minus root 2 whole square. That is equal to 4 minus 2 equal to 2. That is what should be your option. Your option should be now C. And that we have to take third. Sec A plus 10A. Into 1 minus sin A. Equal to. A. Sec A. B. Sign A. C. Cosec A. D. Cos A. Right? Now it is another type of problem. Here you don't have numerical values now. You are having trigonometric ratios. Second tan A, you express them in sin A and cos A. Sec A plus tan A into 1 minus sin A is given to us. What is sec A? 1 upon cos A. Sec A is 1 upon cos A. Tan A is what? Sin A upon cos A. Into 1 minus sin A. As it is. What is common here? 1 upon cos A. So 1 plus sin A into 1 minus sin A. One upon cos A. Now it is of the form A plus B into A minus B again. So you can use A plus B into A minus B equal to A square minus B square. That means 1 square minus sin square A. What is 1 minus sin square A? Can anyone tell quickly? 1 square is 1 only, no? This will be cos square A. Yes, very correct. Yesterday I have told sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1. 
So 1 minus sin square equal to cos square a. 1 minus cos square a equal to sin square a. So cos a and square here will cancel. You will get cos a. So what is option? Option is 